Hello and welcome to the dumbest show on the internet, number six with cheese. Uh, we have a little bit of background in Mambo Italianos. We have the Stromboli from Screaming Sicilian, which we, for lack of a better term, nutted over. We loved it. Well, chips are weird. Mm, I like that. Move on. And to get a gift that little extra. <laughs> I sounded like the Pillsbury Doughboy. And before you can say it, I know I resemble him. <laughs> the only thing I can focus on, what's this guy's superpower? Shooting energy out of his groin? I don't like, I don't like a lot of stuff on the menu. Just give it attendees. I need to floss my teeth. <laughs> you want to do that on camera? <laughs> I need to floss my teeth. <laughs> You seem like somebody that might butt chug some peanut oil, but I assume most of the world has a very basic branch palette. Yeah. And I have more of this worldly uppity yeah. uh, tongue. It's from Ew, bro! Oh! Did you see it fling? No, she just licked it. She took it out from her teeth and then licked the string, bro. I just ate. No, no, oh. that doesn't make it better. She got some uh, chicken fries up on that, dude. Oh. Grippo's kind of sounds like what an Italian calls a lady's pussy. <laughs> <laughs> she had a real grippo last night. <laughs> it sucks in right down to my thing. That was kind of a vampire. So if you lean up a lot like you do, your head's gonna look like the moon <laughs> compared to my skull. Yeah, also, you have some in your teeth. Good start for me. It looks so gross to me. It really is. Highly chugs it. She said she was on a conference call the other day, work call, and she almost chugged some milk. And then she was like, oh, don't do this on business meetings. That's you can't so be funny. chugging milk on business You can't meetings. be. That is the most foul thing. Bro, that's disturbing. I, you watch somebody lick floss and tell me it's not gross. Hopefully, maybe it's from three weeks ago. She's I don't picking know. Her nose. You're lucky you're rich. All right. So these are spicy Cajun craw taters. This better taste like a craw, daddy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> the gremlin's back. Homeless girl peeking through the ring light. And that right there, right there. Kitty. Now which one's this one? A ranch? It's just <laughs> That's what it looks like a little bit. Wanna go throw this at one of them girls back down the beach with you? You guys need to realize that the staples of your city, the things your city is known for, are human piles of trash. They got a little hook back here. Get, bro, she's, oh, I'm telling you. When I say she's a, she's a swamp rat, bro. Yeah, bro. She's a dirty, I know. Swamp rat, you're a mayfly. You're a little fly that gets born once a month and just gets crunched on by tires and feet. And it really does smell like a dog treat. I love how serious people get about food. Like, 94% of the time, we're just joking about everything we so say. Funny. And people are sitting there going, oh, oh, I'm gonna kill these guys. Feels pale ale. <laughs> we'll wash the dog food out your mouth. No one is still watching this video. Bro, there's neck beards who don't even do that, dude. There's what? Neck beards that don't even do that. <laughs> they got more self-respect, bro. <laughs> That sounds like a venereal disease where your dick starts to grow bark on it. Yeah, dude, you see, oh, your dick's looking a little barky, dude. You got Gerwood? <laughs> <laughs> now, don't get me wrong with this as well. Like, if I was drinking with Corey all day and somebody threw this pizza down in front of me, I would be the happiest little fatty there ever was. You know what you smell like? Torula yeast. I don't know, most of these ingredients. Oh, I've got an infection. <laughs> Just wanna apologize real quick. He's got a beer? He's got a beer. Yes, bro! A cup of beer. This dude's drinking and driving. And he's getting into his Chrysler M300 and about to skedaddle. Yeah, which by the way, just to give this a little bit of context, it's 147 <laughs> in the afternoon, getting in his Chrysler 300, this old ass <laughs> white dude with like a, a clear solo cup, it's not like a can of beer. What you'd get at like a rock show. Yeah, like, like I'll take a Bud Light for $7. Yeah, it's like a get, kegger beer. A kegger beer. Yeah. One or the other. How else are you trying to get Jack, bro? The sure. more peanut uh, butter and peanut, I guess, good fat elements uh -huh. that you get up in your body, the more Jack you get. I learned that from all my beast mode friends. That can't be true. Exchange. What about you? Oh, look, chicken rat. Ooh, that's a free one. Yeah, bro. And why stop there? Normalize eating your dinner out of a trough, eating it out of a blender. What do you, you know, like? I usually am not a big cheese puffs guy. Oh wow, that you see, that's weird to me because you look like you eat a lot of cheese puffs. <laughs> How do you not look at that and go? Tonight we're getting Coyote's number two restaurant. <laughs> Pride. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Here's yes. some presents for Farley when she gets home from daycare. Bye, Crumbs. Wee! Wee! He's an adult. 